Hey guys, it's Hamster Hotel, back with you again. Um, today, I'm going to make a video of me making a new room for the Hamster Hotel. And a new, ex well, like, an accessory, I guess, you know. Alright, so, this is the accessory slash room, I guess, I don't know. It is a three triplet bunk bed. Um, I will add a ladder to it so they can get up here. And there's that. Um, and this little ordinary box, I'm going to turn it into a very useful room for the hotel. Um, I'm going to start with the room. So let me get my stand. Um, okay. I am going to use scissors. Just going to put a hole like right in the corner. Um, stronger scissors might be better, but this is just what I had in my room. You may think they'll chew on it. Yeah, they might, but if they make another hold leading to them disappearing in your room, then you should put the box or your other room somewhere else. Not near the edge or anything next to a wall that is already blocked off. Maybe kind of hard. Uh, you want to take one of your biggest hamsters and kind of size it up with the hole you're making. Because if you put that hamster in here, you might want to make the hole big enough. Um, Daisy, my biggest hamster, roams around the room. She never goes in here, so I'm just going to make it kind of small. Just like that okay if it's you don't have to like sawdust any or anything because it's not sharp if they don't like it then they'll chew on it well uh, next the flaps um, you have a choice of leaving them on or taking them off I'm going to leave them on because I'm going to turn this into a bathroom. Yes, a bathroom. They probably won't go to the bathroom in this right away, but you can train them. Yes, you can train hamsters. That is what I said. So, the only thing you need to do is you can take markers and decorate it, or you could just put the bedding in there and make it a bathroom. Um, I'm not going to really decorate it. Well, I will decorate it, but first I'm going to show you the accessory. So, here is the triple bunk bed. Um, I don't know where to put it. I mean, pretty full. We could enlarge it, but they can go under this. That's a problem. Let's see. I think 
me just put it right here. And what? Away from the wall, so they don't get up there. Um, and then this ladder here, they never go up here anyways, because they know it's a punishment room. So, I'll just put that here. I might get a smaller ladder. Um, that is what I wanted to show you. Um, I'll decorate it, the box, for you. Give you some ideas real quick. Okay, so, I'm not really going to decorate it today. I meant, like, uh, I have a notebook. And I'll just show you stuff, because I don't have all my own art stuff up here. Um, you could do polka dots. Like that. You could do spirals. Like that. Um, you could even do stripes, crisscross, plaid, whatever you want to call it. Or you could just write your logo on it. Like that. Let's tell. Or you could do all three. I mean, make it crazy. Put smiley faces all over it. Like that. Um. Yeah, just use normal boxes and it will get you a long way with your hamster hotel. One more thing. Do not put your Zuzu pets with your hamster. Um, I kind of experimented. Uh, they don't like it at all. It could squish them, put them in shock, or give them a heart attack. Like, you know, scare them enough that they'll die. So please don't put your Zuzu pets, if you get any or have any, just leave them alone in their hamster hotel, and they'll do fine. Um, if you're wondering where Aurora is, she's getting a little time out right now. She's been trying to get out. Well, that's all I have for you. <clears throat> Once I do decorate this, I will right away give you a video of it. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you soon and subscribing and commenting. Thanks.